You guys want to go for the boat the con? Yeah. Yeah, good idea, Jack. Dude, that's like a two hour thing. Let's go. Two hours. Come on, come on, come on. It's gonna sink, it's gonna sink. I bet it's gonna sink. <laughs> you ready? Oh, it hurts. Don't drop it. At least tell me you're gonna break my nose. Push. If your life means anything, push. A little while ago, we found this old boat in the woods and decided to tow it back to the barn. Nobody knows if it'll float or not, but there's only one way to find out. I just heard a crack. Oh. Okay, stop, stop. <sighs> Push that. Push that. My strength is only capable to hold it up. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, this is the stupidest idea. <laughs> you actually thought of this. How did you do that? <laughs> Boy, crap, that's a load. Yeah. Drop it at three, two, one. Look at there's a hole right there in the very back. Where? Oh well. Yeah, oh well. Ready, you get in. Wait, hey, hey, let me let me test it. Let me test it from here. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, it actually floats. I told you. Oh, oh, oh. Get to oh, the. Yes, they're gonna sink. My favorite part is how you could have easily jumped out, but you just rocked the whole boat upside down. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, let's get out before it gets more flooded. Why don't we just dock it right here? That was the funniest thing ever. This is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I've already got four. Tip it upside down. Dude, we're just gonna have our own honey business. Honey business. Whoa! She didn't get him. Dude, did we actually not let Henny get out? No, we didn't. You guys are so evil. Molly, none of them are hurt except for the ones that are crawling on their backs. What if we just got to the We need to find a different location. What if we got to the point right go there? Let me get him. No, he's gone. Hey, Ma, I... <laughs> Run! Oh. <laughs> he tripped and the pot broke in his hand. His hands are like sliced open. So, like, what should we do? Just rinse them off or what? Okay, bye. It feels like they're burning. What did Mike say? He said rinse them off. He'll be there in 10 minutes. Or that pisses me off. The one time in my life I trip, I have a glass bottle in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what we got. I feel like I went so pussy, Mike. It's like coming out. It's like something's trying to, like a mole hole. Well, you, what you did is you couched it, and now it's sticking up, right? Yeah. Whenever my parents are away, my dad's business partner, Mike, uh, usually sticks around to keep an eye on us. I was definitely glad that he was around to help today. This is an antiseptic towel. Oh, it germs off. So pissed. I mean, it's just so this, annoying. Is, this is the kind of thing where it's like you drop into a 20-foot cliff 800 times and you go off a curb and break your ankle. <laughs> With Matt off to another meeting across town, I thought I'd just take a little time for myself. While it's great getting away for a little time in New York, I still wonder what the kids are doing while we're gone. Hello, Amy. Hey. Jeremy kind of cut his hand on a, on a broken piece of glass, so I'm sitting here bandaging it up for him. What? Oh, no, no, nothing's that big. It's just like little scrapes and gouges. We got it under control here. I hate hearing that one of my kids got hurt while I'm out of town. 
Thankfully, it doesn't sound too bad, and Mike is there to help. Okay, bye. Okay. Okay, what's next? Yeah. We just came back here one day, man. I forgot this swamp was back here, so I was like, oh, this is such a cool, nice little hideout type place. We should just build something back here. And it's gonna be like a house on stilts, kind of. So when the water comes in, we just thought that'd be, water. We just thought that'd be, be kind of cool, like in a swamp. Hey, what's up? The more coats, the longer it'll last. So we can do like three coats, maybe. We could do this all night. <laughs> right now, we're. Uh, Getting the stilts and painting it with this wood protector so when it gets wet, it won't crumble. All the other forts we're just throwing together. This one, I think we're trying to take a little more time. As far as getting it finished, it depends on how motivated Jeremy stays, and that depends on how quick we get it finished. Right now we're just at the point where we just have the main square floor base down. We need to cut this. We're gonna put uh, the floor cross members on and then when we're all finished, it's supposed to be like an off the ground fort because this is a swamp and it fills up with water. So it should be like above the water and like a sweet little fort. I'm just glad that dad's in New York so uh, we can do it how we want to do it.